On the 24th of November 2021, I saw a vision of the headquarters of the EU in Brussels, a plain government building with an archway, the entryway, and in the archway standing a high-ranking SS officer in silhouette, um, quite distinct. And the word that went with this image said this, Beneath the archway of World Government Headquarters in Brussels, a high-ranking Nazi SS officer stands in silhouette. The tail of his trench coat extend in a flourish of forward motion. He will reign for a season unopposed until the hour of his demise. The men of perdition who leads the whole earth astray. You will see his face on TV screens and recognise him straight away as pure evil. A cold man with fine hair and a purple and scarlet ring on his left index finger. It will come in days of silent accord with the nations of the earth. You are witnessing the formation of this plan before your eyes. Already the clock is ticking, yet many are deceived. They cannot yet see what is about to unfold. You can share your story and open their eyes to the world of the spirit. Only those with eyes to see can understand what is about to unfold. Just before Russia entered into Ukraine, 2022, 24th of, De of February, on the 19th, I see a decoy dummy, something similar to, to what was used on the day of D-Day when the Allied troops left the beaches of Normandy. And this decoy was descending in a parachute. They used these decoys to distract the Nazis from the beaches in Normandy so that the soldiers could escape and not be trapped there and um, killed on the beach. So I see this decoy and then I see a steep set of stairs first covered in cream carpet and a man ascending the stairs. The steps become increasingly steep vertical toward the top. They are red and well-worn. And on his right-hand side, I see a thin red line. This vision relates to the vision from 2021. The rise to power of the Antichrist from the headquarters of Brussels. On the left hand side of the thin red line which comes from the crimean war in 1850 between the british and the russians so today the conflict that's taking place is focused again on crimea and it's a decoy for what's taking place in the g7 nato eu headquarters in brussels the rise to power of what scripture describes in Daniel eleven twenty three, 23 of the man of perdition. I've considered a little bit more the details of scripture, the prophetic images that John received in Revelation concerning these parties, the Antichrist from Brussels, who will be a Nazi, and the peace treaty that is signed between NATO, the EU, the G7 nations, and Israel will be breached three and a half years into the agreement.